Right Dad, um, I'm just going to try and talk you through using Google Maps with this. Um, I hope I don't make any mistakes, so here we go. I've just signed in as yourself, as it says up there where the arrow is uh, with Philip. And now I'm going to ask for directions by just hovering over there, um, over that arrow sign there. I'll click on that. So choose starting point. We'll use your home address. 345 Sandy Fields Road, it's taking us straight there and destination and I've got the card in front of me so that's St. Editha's Church and just with a comma and then hopefully they'll find it with Amington Uh, let's and then just press you can either press enter or click the search button there right and it's found it as you can see there are different routes to get there I'm not sure which one you're going to use um, think that one's the black country route and then using the toll road which is that one is 49 minutes or the M6 which is 57 minutes but as we can see they're both the same distance that's getting there by train obviously we're not interested in that so whichever route you're choosing if you just hover over it with your arrow it shows you the pictures of that position where your finger is so it will give you a better idea of what it looks like as you're driving along because if you're anything, well, if I'm, I know I'm quite like you in the fact that I tend to get lost very easily as my mind wanders. So anyway, if you're catching the toll road all the way down to there, or if you're getting the M6, that will be that road. So you can click on that one. So it's now selected that particular way. Looking to the left here. If we're going on that M6 road, 57 minutes, 33.9 miles, you can ask it for details, click on details, and there we have the basics of the details of getting there. If you want further details, it will give you them down here where it breaks up the route into each turn you have to get. And then you can click on that one so from there and then click on that one so if you want to print that out um, so that you've got a record in case you get lost what you can do is you see the print icon there just click on that and it will take you to your printer and you just tell it how you you know just press OK with how many pages it turns out to be um, it will also, depending on the time of day, take make allowances for traffic. Um, don't usually use that myself, so I'm gonna I'm learning as I'm discussing it really. Uh, if we go back from there, having printed it, uh, we can have a look at options. So you can also tell it avoidances and how you want the miles kilometers presented as you're going along if you want to take a closer look now at St. Aditha's Church what you can do is as you've got your finger hovering around that area it doesn't have to be spot on if you grab the map and pull it towards the center it will zoom in now if you want to see what it looks like if you're walking along the street or driving along there what you do is you pick bottom right hand corner where I've moved the arrow you pick up your yellow man here and you place him where you want to look and get a 360 view of that position so I've got my hand over him there I'm gonna left click with my mouse button so I've got my finger depressed now and I'm holding on to the man 
and I'm pulling him to as you can see there's like a green shadow and a circle pulling him to where I want to drop him along the route so if we have him say at that junction roughly there and then just release your left mouse button and there we are so as you can see to your right you've got St Aditha's Church and this is the Tamworth Road here if you want to drive up or down there you can see the arrow where my f the little finger icon is if you left click it'll move in that direction if you want to go back the other way once again you're grabbing the map by left clicking at any position and moving grabbing the map and moving yourself around so now we're facing the other way so if you want to familiarize yourself with this area and how to get there because I'm not really sure which roads you're going to be getting here on um, once again I'm going to move that way by left clicking so we're further down the road and a little bit further down and then you can actually what I do sometimes is wait for it and then you can see some of the route signs which often get you a better idea of where you are just coming up to this roundabout if it took you a long time uh, today driving around there I suspect you've probably seen that roundabout a few times right anytime you want to escape from this and go back to the map down at your bottom left hand side there's a little sign that says back to your map left click on that just as an aside these are pictures people have taken of the local area which you can click on and familiarize yourself with if you wanted to just to get to know the area um, they've put those on Google to sort of advertise their businesses perhaps or sites of interest anyway back to map click on back to map and there we are back to St Aditha's Church in the centre if you want to zoom out you've got your little wheel on your mouse and you just move that with your index finger towards you and you're zooming out as you can see the area we're looking at has moved to the left of your screen so once again what you can do just grab it with your left clicking on your left mouse button and just move it into the center and then zoom in by moving the wheel on your mouse away from you and that zooms in there are some other options here down at your bottom right hand corner which we can perhaps discuss at a later time this is the first uh, recording that I've uh, done so I'm hoping it will work and I can send it to you um, I think that's about it um, also yeah just quickly so you got an option as well for Google Earth if you click on that it will show the area of coverage on your screen as Google Earth ie satellite image so perhaps we can just click on that now and that's showing your route which if you want to see more of your route you can zoom out and that should appear otherwise I'm going to look a bit silly there let's zoom out a little bit and a little bit more and that's your whole route and that is Google Earth image of your route on the M6 if you want to escape from that I've got to have a look myself I assume you've got a little arrow oh that's collapsed the side panel um, let's have a look ah, yeah, easy bottom left hand corner back to map so